your time scrapping a little uh, table lamp. I'm going to make uh, some other videos on lamps because uh, there's so many different kinds and uh, different variables involved. But if you haven't seen my videos before, I don't show you how to scrap something. I just kind of get you in the ballpark of what something may be worth just taking to your scrap yard as is or taking home and spending a few minutes tearing it apart. So we're going to get a baseline here uh, and we're going to get started. I don't scrap full time. Um, I have been scrapping for over 20 years, but I'm not a know-it-all. Uh, there's variables and everything. I just use these videos as kind of a personal, I don't know, a personal archive of what things might be worth just picking up and taking to the scrap yard or taking home. Uh, this time I'm just cleaning out the garage and I've had these little things sitting around and I'm just getting them done and I just kind of wanted to put these in my archives and see what they're worth. So I uh, hope you take something out of it, and I am going to end this with a short disclaimer. I hope you enjoyed. Thanks. I'm going to keep this short and keep you YouTuber police off my back with a few disclaimers. Uh, number one, scrap value is always the lowest price for an item, just above garbage. Uh, so if you bring something home that works or has working parts, consider selling it on Craigslist, eBay. That's actually how I make a lot of money. Uh, number two, scrap prices change with the stock market. Uh, good rule of thumb, like I stated, but not fact. Uh, when oil prices are high, usually scrap prices go up, and then vice versa. Um, for the purpose of this video, I just stated the prices from the last trip I made, uh, so they're not going to be your prices. So I'm just using these as comparisons for the video. Number three, come on, use common sense. We're working with metals. They're sharp. Uh, they have sharp edges. Wear gloves. Protective eye gear. Do what you need to do to keep yourself from going to the hospital and cutting to any profit you might make.